Hello, today we will talk about how to transition from the swim lane based system behavior simulation, which represents how system shall work in most cases, because it starts from the use cases, goes to functional analysis, right? As we can see here, to actual system behavior, when it is lo locate, uh, located in the blocks, representing each block's modular behavior, communicating through interfaces. And how to show that actually in the step-by-step -step transitioning from the swim lane base, uh, easy to understand, uh, single place for scenario uh, system behavior to that uh, distributed behavior. And sometimes we just need to have creative uh, solution to show that uh, communication in the swim lanes at the same time having actual behavior, you know, in the blocks. So here, first of all, you know, let's run this uh, simulation. As you can see here, scenario is executed, right? Uh, and we can't really even uh, do some things here. For example, we can show scenario, right? But like we can't send the uh, signals between the sent and accept event action. The swim lanes in most cases are dedicated for actually workflow simulation for using control and object flows, right? Because as a result of that, we will go to interface modeling and uh, uh, so on. So the send and accept signal actions is mostly not for the swim lanes. Um, sure, we can send signal through port and see that it's sending here, but we can't receive as you can see here. So what would be the way to transition? So here in the second scenario here, we have a system, right? Which already have behaviors defined uh, at least one behavior defined here in the block, right? So it could have for both blocks, you know, with the behaviors. So now we want to simulate and it can simulate, you know, it will communicate, right? And we can still show the swim lanes for the different scenarios representation, right? We can just take those diagrams and drag them here. Selecting containment tree, drag them here like that show the content you see it show the content and uh, make them maybe larger you know and uh, simulate and in that case we will run actual behaviors inside of the block but at the same time we would monitor as if we are running through the swim lanes and see how that uh, how that works so here we have you see waiting for the signal sending signal receiving signal so very convenient uh, sure walk around but uh, at the same time bridging the two concepts together thank you